My name is Justin Walseth. I am a commercial real estate broker with Cressa San Diego. To give you a little background on our firm, Cressa has 58 offices across the country. Most importantly, as a pure tenant representation firm, we just exclusively represent tenants, so we have no conflicts of interest. This is a short video update for the Carlsbad office market for third quarter 2013. Cressa's influence in the Carlsbad market is substantial. Over the last three years, we've completed over 20 transactions for a number of Fortune 500 companies. The Carlsbad office market consists of 7.6 million square feet of office or flex space. There are 27 Class A properties, 82 Class B properties, larger than 20,000 feet, and 61 flex buildings with over 3.5 parks per 1,000 square feet. In terms of asking rents, rates range in Carlsbad between $2.20 to $2.85 full-service gross or net of utilities. Triple net rents range between $1.50 and $1.85 with triple nets between a quarter and 35 cents. In terms of vacancies, Carlsbad's Class A and Class B office markets are sitting at just about 17 percent. Just to give you a comparison looking at the UTC Class B market, Carlsbad has roughly four and a half times as many properties but the difference in rate uh, asking rent in Carlsbad is $1.91 versus a $2.37 rate that would equate to about a quarter of a million dollars over a five-year period for a 10,000 square foot office lease. So as you can see, the difference in rate really sets Carlsbad apart as one of the more attractive markets in North County, San Diego. Outside of rental rates, Carlsbad remains to be an attractive market. They've got a regional airport and high quality infrastructure. Many of the buildings are post-2000 construction and also golf courses, theme parks, and coastal access. As you can see, Carlsbad remains attractive not only because of the low rates, but because many of the properties have been sitting on the market much longer than those in neighboring submarkets of Serrano Mesa, UTC, and Delmar Heights. This bodes well for tenants because when landlords are in competition with one another, they'll be more desperate for your tenancy. Over the last five years, you can see Carlsbad remains below the other three North County submarkets, but most importantly, we've seen a divergence over the last 12 months, and our estimate is that these will continue to converge. I think we'll continue to see Carlsbad well below the other three markets by at least a quarter or 30 cents. In terms of recent activity, RF Surgical has relocated into 23,976 square feet at 5927 Landau Court. Procopio has vacated their location in Cornerstone Corporate Center uh, which is now up for sublease through 2018. CDM Smith has renewed their 18,000 square foot lease at the plaza. And finally, Activision has relocated into 18,251 square feet at 2051 Palomar Airport Road. Since June 2013, the sales activity has been robust. $116.4 million worth of assets have traded hands, and we're very close to reaching the pre-2006 recession values. Properties traded were Class B and Class A properties valued anywhere between $175 a foot up to $278 a foot for a Class A property at 5759 Fleet Street. Now to offer up a few conclusions. Uh, this sales activity I just mentioned is a reflection of the bullish outlook for high quality assets throughout the county. Uh, also, Class A vacancies remain very low and that's also consistent with levels in other submarkets. We expect rents to rise modestly between a nickel and a dime over the next 12 months. Class B rents should stay steady in the $1.50 range until larger spaces are absorbed. And also from a new leasing standpoint, we expect incentives to remain strong for relocating tenants. That wraps it up for our third quarter 2013 Carlsbad update. Again, I'm Justin Walseth with Cressa San Diego. We look forward to working together on any tenant requirements in the future.